You dropped a bombshell on episode one about you and James. I'm loving this honesty. I mean, you've always been honest. Um, was that like word vomit or did you plan to say that about you and him having hooked up while you were new to your respective relationship? No, it definitely, I, this season going into it, I just felt like my life was, it was just, I was sitting in a pile of shit and I just wanted all of my skeletons out. I wanted to start making amends to people who I've affected and maybe I shouldn't have told her because she was upset about it. Um, but hindsight's 2020. I felt in the moment that I was doing something that I needed to do for both of us because we were in a great place and I wanted to move forward with her. And I just couldn't move forward with her knowing that I had been someone who I'm not proud of in the past. Do you and Raquel end up talking about that situation? We do. You're going to see a lot of ups and downs with Raquel and I. It's intense. And where are we right now with Raquel? We're not great, but that's okay. <laughs> That's okay though. That's to be expected with this group. We are there's never calm waters with this group. Lala made some very um, shocking claims during the premiere. She said that she and James hooked up when they were you guys were each new to your other relationships. Um, did that come as a shock to you, or did you already know that? Shock. Yeah, I was mad at him for a minute, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think I felt for Raquel a lot in that moment and just knowing like you guys were about to get married and she was never going to know this. It was a little bit of that kind of, you know, yeah, and that's never fun to find out about a partner. But um, yeah, we talked it through and he came home and told me about it the night that Lala brought it up, which I was thankful for. But yeah. James, were you mad at Lala for saying that? Be honest. Honestly, no. I haven't got time to be mad at Lala about something that happened six years ago. We've already worked on our, our friendship so much since then, you know, and I know that it happened. It's, I'm obviously not proud of that. Um, you know, definitely learned from my lessons, and that's not the man that I am today. So um, Lala and I can still remain friends. I'll forgive her this time. And Ali, do you have any concerns with James' friendship with Lala? Honestly, no, I don't. I don't. <laughs> 